Okay guys, this is Guy with Civil War Beer coming at you with the beginning of another fairly long term project. Uh, this is a knit story by the name of Harvest, made by uh, Felic and Niflis. Music by Niflis. I don't remember if this is one that Niflis made himself and whatnot. Or. But, okay, it's a new game, July 15th, July 15th, yeah, and you start out with run, and I kind of want to explore right now, see what you can find, this land looks fertile, it'll be good for planting, where can I find some seeds, so the beginning of this is, basically the plot is you just came here and you're wanting to, uh, they want you to start farming. It's, some people really hate this. I really like this. So you're the new owner of the farm. I'm Erica. And you might be able to find some seed in town. Okay. And her house is locked. So we just go along crossing through here. Get used to this track. We're doing it a lot. More people. Howdy. My name is Samson. You don't look like a hard worker. My hubby is hard, hardest worker around. Without him, I'd probably be dead somewhere. Yeah, that was probably creepy for y'all. But, I'll probably keep doing it. Hey, I'm Doyle. That guy Samson said I was weak. I heard he says, says that to everyone. Okay. Doyle. I had a band director by the name of Doyle. Doyle Thornton. It's weird. What do you have to say? I'm Bear. You look like some. Ad look like you need some advice. Do I look smart to you? Fine, crazy old man. Let's go to the bar. Hey, I'm Rico. Did you come here to have a drink and be lonely too? Um, no. I came looking for seed. Yeah. Uh, what do you say? Did you? Did you know this bar was run by two kids? I'm Rosa, by the way. Okay. What? Okay, then, um. You still looking for some seeds, farmer? Doyle's a nice guy. He might help you out. Okay, I guess we're gonna go talk to Doyle. And let's get going. One thing about this game is it does start slow. Like, after, it's been a while. I've beaten this game. Or the story, whatever you want to call it. But it's been a long time since the beginning. I forgot how slow this starts. So this first episode is probably going to be fairly boring. And don't tell me I passed by Doyle. I probably did. I passed by Doyle. And I think I said something different right there. What did I say? The homeless bear said Doyle might be able to give me some seeds. Oh, so he's homeless and not just an old man who sits there? I don't know, I thought it was an old man that just kind of sat there. Oh, I guess he's homeless. For him. And I need to start paying more attention to where I'm going. Doyle's house, I can't wall climb yet. Is not this one? No, that's Samson's house. It's this one, right? Yes. You need some corn seeds? You got some over there on the table. Um, okay. Take Doyle's corn seeds? Yes, I will. We gotta help each other out, you know? Um, sure. So it's nighttime. And after a long day's work of picking up seeds, I think that'd be a long day's work, but... We head back to our house, and that's a big rat. Everyone else is locked in their houses. It's probably scared. You no, know, new new knit comes to town. Everyone's probably scared out of their minds. I don't know what I'm saying anymore. July 15th. Let's save and let's go to sleep. I should probably go to sleep soon. And so the seeds were planted. And two weeks passed. Chapter 2. All work and no play. Okay then, this is something very exciting, and it is August 2nd, 
Let's go check on our crops. The corn has sprouted. Yay! What's over here? Really nice view. It's one thing about Nifless games. They're always just as important on how things look and just the ambience of everything. In addition to just the uh, gameplay and the story. However, it is nice to have some story. And let's go to the bar, I guess. Unless this place is open. It is open. What do you have to say? I heard Samson's wife is missing. I know you two don't get along, but maybe you can help. Well, I guess we should. I forgot where Samson lived. <clears throat> Excuse me. And I can't make that jump again. I think this is Samson, right? No, I ain't alright. You see my wife? You tell her to come home. Oh, oh, okay, guy. Um, your house is locked, too. What does Dora have to say about all this? How's the coin? Oh, I found something weird while I was plowing, the fi plowing this morning. It's in my house. Okay. So you found something interesting and you just kind of leave it and let people come and take it. And you say the same thing. And we have wall climb now. Yay. And I don't remember if you have to right now, but generally, it's a good idea to remember if you're ever stuck trying to figure out what to do, go to the bar. People like to talk at the bar and do other random stuff. Too early to drink? What? Are you crazy? And no, I don't know where Samson's wife is. I slept here last night. It was cold and embarrassing. Um, Rico? You might want to go get some help. Just an idea. But, anyway. Let's continue as we pass more and more people's houses. And the place we're going to want to go. And which will actually be a starting place for a lot of your adventures here as you try to grow some corn. Is this area. So, we just got wall climb. And let's put it to use. Let's see what's up here. Not too tricky of jumps, especially if you've played this before. Got a snail right there. Yay, snail. Uh, I say it's not hard. And yet here I am not able to make simple jumps. There we go. Simple jumps. Simple jumps. What's over here? And doesn't really lead anywhere, so let's just... I guess we do have to go this way. That's right, we don't have double jump or high jump. So we'll just avoid blue face thing. Blue chomper. That's green chomper. We should also avoid him. That's what I'm calling him from now on. Green chomper. His name is green chomper in this game. And I hate those things. So you have to go by blue chomper. Or mini. And there's another one right there. Jeez. I have definitely forgot a part of this game. Actually, I don't think I ran into those the first time I played. Oh, wow. Well. And I wish Nit would stop. Junie would, Nit, whatever her name is, would stop hitting her head on that. There we go. Now let's just continue on. Blue Chomper. Yeah, yeah. You haven't got me in a long time. So, this is how you're supposed to tell if something's there. You see those little white marks? Those are the teeth of Green Chomper. And you don't want to touch them or fall on the edge like I just did. So, we just have to keep on pressing through. And avoid Blue Chomper. And actually get past Green Chomper. Now, green next one's right down there. Okay, good. I didn't fall. A save point and let's keep going and you got to trigger him to fall now there's another green chomper guy right there you can kind of see his teeth I did not fall and there's something we won't and I just got ate by green chop by blue chomper yeah okay so that's after image anyone who's played this before will recognize it it is useful 
to say the least, whatever. There's another green chomper. I'm not sure how to trigger. Oh, I guess you just kind of go faster than him. Or was this the radar? Oh no, this is the radar. My bad. This is this is something that's in regular the regular knit, which you have by default, which is extremely useful. And I just lost that. Dang it! I have to go get that again. Well, you know what? I'm about at time, so I'm gonna go get that and be right back.